My name is Dr. Kate McLean, and I'm an obstetrician here in the United States and abroad. I'd like to invite you to come with me to see what it's like to give birth on Lake Tanganyika in Tanzania. The lake is one of the most beautiful parts of the country, but it's also one of the most remote and isolated. The average woman here has six children and lives more than 70 kilometers from the nearest hospital. Roads are bad, making travel really difficult, and even if a patient actually does make it to a health facility, it may not have the infrastructure to give her the care she needs. There's a high risk of maternal and infant death, and that's why the nonprofit I work for, the Lake Tanganyika Floating Health Clinic, is striving to make birth safer here. We began at a health center in the village of Kirando, where, as you can see, there's no running water or electricity. Our team installed a solar power system, as well as surgical lighting, making it possible for the staff to provide emergency obstetrical services, including cesarean sections and neonatal resuscitation. We also trained the healthcare workers in family planning, which has resulted in thousands of women getting long-lasting contraception, such as intrauterine devices and implants. However, our work isn't even close to being done. Millions of women live along Lake Tanganyika, and there are many, many more health centers just like Kirando. With your support, together we can save lives.